At Nobat Mao's first press briefing after the January election, he emphasized the rebuilding of the party, especially with the key loopholes highlighted during that period. But we shall not only stop at the policy organs. Our secretariat and the administrative structure of the party needs a comprehensive evaluation and overhaul. And I'll be leading that process, bringing in new professionals who will make our headquarters look business-like. Before the elections, there was a massive exodus of DPMPs to other opposition parties, especially the National Unity Platform. Mao maintained that even with these exits, the party was stronger and he vowed to resign if they did not raise 15 MPs. His talk was different today. The moment I made that pronouncement, I was approached by those who genuinely love DP. And I was told never to repeat that statement of resigning again. A lot of key leaders who love DP told me, Mr. President, that is not leadership. That is abdication of leadership. Indeed, I abandoned that idea. Mao also scoffed at those who criticized the party. The anger directed against DP is because this time they have failed to take advantage of DP. Let me put it to you crudely. They have failed to screw us, so they are very angry. They, 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 they are disappointed and angry because they are used to taking advantage of DP. But this time they have no but Mao and a new team. This is not the old DP. According to Mao, the party avoided alliances for the 2021 elections with the belief that many are opportunistic and are not looking at taking over power. Ali Mivule, NTV.